Your Natchez History Minute is brought to you by Natchez National Historical Park. The term Italian diaspora refers to the large-scale migration of Italians to America in the late 19th and early 20th centuries. Working with local Mississippi and Louisiana plantation owners, labor brokers arranged for Italian families to relocate to America for employment. A small group from the province of Bologna left everything behind, boarded ships, and set sail for the United States. They arrived at Ellis Island, traveled by cattle car to Vicksburg, and were displaced among several plantations in the Mississippi Delta and across the river in Louisiana. Their hopes of independence and prosperity quickly faded as they realized they were now participants in a system of involuntary servitude. Undaunted, the Vincinelli brothers sought assistance from Natchez businessman and landowner R. Lee Parker, who, along with the Tilsley and Moran families, assisted the Italian immigrants. Soon, the Bescheri, Muscagni, Monte, Stallone, Barucchi, Vincinelli, and Zaccaroli families settled on the old Washington Road near St. Catherine Creek. They applied their skills of raising and selling vegetables and began to eke out a living. Plantation owners pressed charges to recoup passage money, but a judgment in St. Joe, Louisiana, ruled that the 13th Amendment prohibited peonage and that the civil rights of the Italian immigrants had been violated. Soon the settlement welcomed the Baroni, Benedettini, Carrazza, Delalio, Maggio, and Zacconi families. The Italian colony on St. Catherine Creek prospered, and their legacy of faith, family, and friendship has become a part of what has made Natchez so special. Hi, my name is Barbara Stallone Lamasney, and I am a direct descendant of the Stallone and Zacconi families. This is your Natchez History Minute.